During the golden age of air travel, from the 1950s to the 1970s, air travel was full of glamour and luxury. Passengers enjoyed cocktail lounges, five-course meals, caviar served from ice sculptures, and an endless flow of champagne. It is how we travel today. If we are lucky, we get a can of soda from airlines. Do you want to enjoy the glamour and luxury of air travel in the golden age? We flew Air Canada Signature Class from Vancouver to London. Air Canada fed us all-we-can-eat gourmet food, an unlimited flow of fine wine. Air Canada was trying to revive the glamour and luxury of air travel for its signature class passengers. Let's see whether it could meet the standards of the golden age. Signature class passengers do not check in at the priority check-in counters, which were for business class. We checked in the flight inside this room with concierge services. For the first time in our life, we could sit down comfortably to check in for a flight. After verifying our passports and tickets, a staff member carried our luggage to the depot. The other staff member informed us how to go to the signature class suite lounge through the fast security lane. That's the concierge. You check in with them to go upstairs, okay? Here is the Signature Class Suite Lounge, a tranquil oasis away from the bustle of the airport. Yeah. Upon arrival, we were warmly greeted by a staff member who escorted us to the lounge. The restaurant is designed to offer a fine dining experience with a menu created by Chef David Hawksworth, one of Canada's most celebrated chefs. It was the first time in our life to see a gourmet food menu with no price tags attached. Yes, it is all-you-can-eat gourmet meals and all-you-can-drink fine wine. I ordered mushroom bisque, foie gras, and poached BC halibut with peas and vermouth sauce. We could relax in comfortable seating while indulging in unlimited supplied delicious gourmet meals and premium beverages, all included with your ticket. A staff member came back again and again to keep our glass of wine and water full. Mushroom bisque offered a satisfying blend of earthiness, richness, and umami flavors. It satisfied all the mushroom lovers and soup enthusiasts. The foie gras was exceptionally creamy and smooth in texture. It melted in our mouths, releasing a luxurious and indulgent flavor. It carried a sweet and slightly nutty taste, with hints of earthiness and a lingering, subtle bitterness. The poached halibut retained its tenderness and moistness, providing a gentle and smooth texture. The halibut's mildness pairs nicely with the sweetness of peas. The vermouth sauce brought a complex and aromatic character to the dish, with hints of herbs and spices. The food was absolutely delicious. Well done! Chef David Hawksworth. I could order more, but I was completely full. If you do not have enough custom cooked gourmet dishes, you can enjoy the gourmet buffet with salad, appetizer, main courses, and desserts. It is also all you can eat. After a banquet of delicious gourmet food, it was time to board the Boeing 777-300ER. The seat was a classic business class seat setting. Amenities kit, noise cancellation headphones, a bottle of water, a pillow and blanket were already placed at the seat. The storage area for personal items was very limited. 
solid table tray could be pulled out for dining and work. The seat could be converted to a comfortable bed with a reading lamp above. The in-flight meal was also by Chef David Hawksworth. Shortly after takeoff, the flight attendants served us a hot casserole of nuts and a glass of fine wine. The nuts tasted much better while it was warm. Most other airlines serve casserole of nuts cold. The starters of the in-flight meal were fruit plate and grilled vegetables. The grilled vegetables offered a delicious taste experience of combination of caramelization, smokiness, and the natural flavors of the vegetables. The main course was grilled chicken breast, which was juicy and properly seasoned in marinade. Breakfast was egg omelet, oatmeal, and fruit plates. Shortly after breakfast, we landed at London Heathrow Airport. Air Canada has transformed our journey to London into a journey of gourmet gastronomy. Do you think that Air Canada has revived the glamour and luxury of air travel? Please leave your comments below.